हेलो एवरी वन होप यू ऑल आर फाइन टूडे ऑन अ बिहाफ ऑफ सी सी टी वी डेस्क वी कम अप विद न्यू वीडियो दिस वीडियो इज ऑल अबाउट अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट ऐप नेम्ड एस आई सी एस डबल ई सो बेसिकली इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस विद यू दैट हाउ यू इंस्टॉल आई सी एस डबल ई ऐप ऑन योर आई फोन एंड how you configure the setting to make the camera live and able to access all its features now first thing we should like to put in front of you that what is ICS double e app actually is it is a app which is used to connect as well as control the cctv camera on pc on mobile phone ios this is applications program for monitoring the cctv cameras on handheld devices it is also used to monitor the cameras over the remote locations now let us start that how you configure them and how you install them so basically in this video we are going to describe you how you install them and how you configure them to make the camera live and able to access all its feature so keep watching please like share our video and subscribe to our channel if you are new one and please press the bell icon so that you get the notification of all upcoming videos so let us start our practical parts now you should open your app store like this and here you should search for ics डबल ई प्रो सो यू यू फाइंड द लॉट ऑफ थिंग लाइक यू हैव आई सी एस डबल ई एंड आई सी एस डबल ई प्रो द बोथ एप आर सेम बट प्रो इज हैव अ सम एक्स्ट्रा फीचर जस्ट क्लिक ऑन दिस बिकॉज आई हैव ऑलरेडी इंस्टॉल्ड अ फ्यू मंथ बैक सो दैट्स वाई दिस क्लाउड ऑप्शन इज इनेबल अदरवाइज यू गेट ऑफ दिन लाइक हेयर यू गेट जस्ट क्लिक ऑन दैट जस्ट क्लिक ऑन दैट एंड now it is take a few minute to con to install on your phone but now it is installed and here you find the option open just click on this open and click on agree and again click allow and again click allow now here it ask for a username and password and you found the login option here you find the sign up option when you click on the sign up option it asks for username and the password and you should and here you get you should enter the email address and click on send verification codes when you click on the send verification code you find that you have a got you you you, you get the code on your on your email and you should enter that code here but i just make this video for education and training purpose so without wasting time one thing you should also do that you should you should click on the local login just click on the local login and click agree and after that just click on this and the this is the interface of the device or of the app and the first thing you should do you should add the add your dvr and vr on this app so on the on the top right corner you should see the plus sign just click on the this plus sign or otherwise just just here you have a pc like uh, in in front of a screen like here you got see that click add a device so both option are same just click on this plus button and here you find the two options set up my wifi in device uh, set up my device in wifi and add share device so if your dvr nvr or cam and your mop and your uh, mobile phone is connected on the same network then you should click on set up my device in wifi otherwise you should click on add share device just click on this add share device okay now here you should find uh, it ask for a serial number and click on add device and another thing you here you uh, you find that scan qr code so if you are in front of your uh, device means then just click on the scan device like this 
or otherwise if you are far away from your device then you should click on you should manually enter serial number here you find a lot of things so just click on the monitor and enter the serial number so here is our serial number now just click on add device and here it should ask your password please note that this is the password of the device I mean the device you are adding in my case i'm using nvr or dvr so i just use the password of the dvr just click on this and click confirm now wait for a few minutes and here it comes online like this and after that just click on this play button again it asks for a password just click on this okay now you here you find that this comes live okay now you see the camera in this way here you find the setting so here it is a basic setting like device name languages and here you should change your passwords of the device and here just click on advanced setting and here you find the record quality you can manage the record quality and record setting and all the things and here in journal you find everything like qr code serial number device name firmware and everything okay and here you should restore also the things and after that hope you like our video thanks for watching have a nice day